spend the next three days with me in the Cameron Cornwall in Montego Bay. All right, see you soon. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Travel with Tony and I'm going to share with you one of my recent stay at Grand de Cameron Cornwall Beach located on the hip strip in Montego Bay, Jamaica. Now, this hotel is about five minutes away from the Sangsas International Airport and it's an all-inclusive budget-friendly hotel. I spent three days and two nights here. And the total when I went in May was approximately 600 US dollars. Now, my check-in process was pretty simple. It was a standard check-in at 3 p.m. And the staff at the front desk basically goes through everything you need to know about the hotel, your hotel room, your Wi-Fi, etc. This is your information brochure on the resort. The room number is located here. Buffet, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So breakfast is between the hours of 7 to 10.30. Lunch is from 12 to 2.30. While dinner is from 6.30 to 9.30. This is just a mini map to say where the areas are. So for example, we're here number one by the lobby. So just behind you, okay, that number three will be the dining room. That's where you go for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, okay? And my favorite part was you get this welcome drinks on arrival. You get the welcome drink, which is, I got a pina colada. Mm. Tastes really good. We're gonna do a room tour, so let's get into it. Oh, here is the room. A lovely entrance is here. And to my left, you have the closet here with all the closet space. You have a couple hangers here, extra linen, an iron, an ironing board, very important. And of course, a safe. Thing is big enough to hold a 17 inch laptop. I'll test that out later. Then we're going to the bathroom. Here's the bathroom. So it's a basic bathroom. You have your, your dryer, your hair dryer, your hair products, your products here, your shampoo, your lotion, your tissue, your towels are here. Um, your toilet here is inside the bathtub. Here is inside the bathroom. Uh, not my favorite, but yeah. This is the shower head. And it looks clean to me. Looks nice. Yeah, basic bathroom setup let's get up here there's a basic bathroom setup here you have your fridge which is stocked i think it's stocked daily here is your fridge stocked daily with two red stripes and two coke well, i have to appreciate the red stripe right <laughs> now here is the television oh, a basic table um no smoking allowed here's your mirror um and there is a bed a little day bed um here you have your king size bed um i have a robe here four pillows and your towel two lights here you have your phone here to call for desk a draw here um i got some fruits here and a little welcome from the camera really really nice i got a champagne popping it later <laughs> And we have some water here and things so it's really nice and then the this is what I love the most the view look at the views this is the views of the pool and the water look at the water it looks so nice look at that water it's so refreshing I can't wait to go outside and just take a dip in that nice water and <laughs> nice pool but the views here are nice the beach is very pretty and wonderful and this is why I love the camera because it's just that one of those hotels that are affordable, children friendly, all inclusive. In Montego Bay, you have the best beach here. And I've been to several hotels in Jamaica and I can definitely say the camera has the best beach ever. <laughs> it's hard to find an all inclusive hotel that's affordable and has the best beach. So yes, the food may not be top tier, but it's okay. And so far, yeah. So. So I'm about, I just checked in, so I'm about to go and get some coffee. There's a cafe here. I'm not sure if it's 24 hours. I'm going to check it out. So I'm going to go to the cafe and get some nice coffee. So follow me. Let's go. All right, I'm thinking I'm gonna get a mocha latte. No problem. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Would you like it to go or would you like to have it here? Uh, I'll have 
it here. Okay, Thank you. So you guys have like pastry and so pastry. What set in the morning and then a different set in the afternoon? Okay. I mean, we don't have the same thing same every day. Okay, that's good. That's good. Like 12 o'clock is Okay, and it open from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Okay. I can get a little top of a liquor in my mocha. Is that that's yeah, your favorite, yes. What about your the rum cream? All right, that's what I'm that's what I'm talking about. Now, as a coffee lover, I love resorts that have cafes. Now, this cafe bar has a great indoor and outdoor space where you can sit and lounge. If you work remotely, it's a great space to work. They also have pastries and nice coffee here for you to enjoy. And if you love to read, they have books here as well. They are open daily between 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Look at that. Thank you so much. Look at all this niceness. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Wow. Kind of dripping. Sorry about that. Yeah. No, that's fine. That's fine. This looks, this looks good, guys. This looks good. I'm going to enjoy this with rum cream. It's a mocha latte with rum cream. So I'm going to enjoy it. So let's. I hope I do hope you enjoy it. I will. I will. I will. Thank you so much. That's a problem. Boy, the hospitality here, ton of canoe, it's really nice. Up here, smile me again, so let's taste it. This is foamy and now. Mmm, nice. Yeah, man, rummy, rummy and nice. Mmm. And this is made from Jamaica Blue Mountain Coffee? Um, that is the High Mountain and it's from Manchester. Oh, see? We're using our local brand here, you know. This is what we, we have to love about. You know, hotels like this that use Jamaican products. The Blue Mountain Coffee is one of the best coffee. So, big up to the Cameron for using Jamaica Blue Mountain Coffee. So I'm off to lunch at the buffet area and they have standard food like rice, different food options like fries, pastas, vegetables, pastries, ice cream, soup. And I do believe they have vegetarian options. You can also get liquor from the bar. It's literally right beside the buffet area. One thing I do like about this hotel is they do have Jamaican food options and ground provisions like yam and green banana. These are on their list and I love that. It's rare to see a hotel that provides this. I particularly enjoy this because I don't really consume a lot of rice. We have some roast pork. I got some vegetable and a piece of yam because I kind of toning it down with the food. I definitely, um, yeah, I definitely trying to lose some weight. So, <laughs> yeah, this is what we're gonna have, and this is the view. Got the view of the beach and everything. Really nice. So I'm here eating the food. The food is not bad at all. It tastes good. The pork is well seasoned and net. I have it with some yam and vegetables. Nice. Now, there are two Decameron resorts in Montego Bay. You have Grand Decameron Cornwall Beach, and that's the one I'm staying in. And then there is Grand Decameron Montego Bay, which is a little bit on the cheaper side to stay. And guests are allowed to go on both properties. It's right beside each other, and we're going to check it out. Now, let's talk about the beach. The beach here is absolutely beautiful. It's on the same stretch as the famous Doctor's Cave Beach. And Doctor's Cave Beach is one of the best beaches for me in Jamaica. It's just beautiful. The sand is beautiful and the water is just amazing.
there is an adult pool which is located on the Grand de Cameron Montecabe property. There is also on that same property a gym and a hot tub jacuzzi and the spa. So this is 75 years old. It was a building by Jack Tar. It was the Jack Tar building. Old. The yeah, old Jack. Jack it was the old Jack Tar building. So all of this is the original stairs that the Cameron kept. How cool. So so we are heading to a room by Montego Bay Beach. Montego Beach. Montego Beach. It's another property that the Cameron own. It's the sister property. And we're gonna take a look at the room. So we're gonna take a room tour of the Montego Bay Beach room. And this is it. Um, here we have the bathroom. Very basic. Um, it's the bathroom. We have our towels, our tissue. Very basic. Um, over here we have our closets with hangers, ironing board, iron, your safe, um, the bed, um, your, your lamp, your phone, your remote, simple, we have your TV here, a nice mirror, hi, your drawers, I don't know what that is. And you have a little nice table here, your water, and your glass, and then the grand finale of the views. Let's see how this goes. So what I like about all the Decameron properties, they have this beautiful view. Look at that. Wow. Decameron has the best views ever, and for me, they have the most beautiful beaches. Look at that postcard ready all the rooms have ocean view and this is what i love 
So here you have the tour disc. You can scan and get the tour operator. Um, this is the daily entertainment that they have. They have a board here with all the entertainment. A full pack day. Here you have our, the spa services that they offer. Yep. And a plane is taking off. They're right beside the airport. <sighs> that don't know if you can see it but a plane just took off There's a nice boardwalk here. This is where you can just sit down, relax, and take in the beautiful views of Montego Bay. And just watch the sun rise and set. It's so beautiful and peaceful out here. You see the beautiful ocean, and it's just relaxing. I love it out here. Here you can see how the water is very nice and clear. Do you see that? It's nice. So here you have the cabanas where people come and just relax. So on each property, there is a central bar by the pool area. That's where you will have games and they're always playing music there. A nice vibe. So guys, I did not show you the most important part of this room and that is the views. No. I've stayed at this hotel before and what I loved was the, the sun set and the sunrise. Beautiful, love it. And so I'm going to give you a glimpse of outside of, in, outside of my room. For all the rooms here are ocean views. So it's beautiful. I'm on the third floor and I'm going to tell you something. The views are just amazing. I can just stare and just, uh, it's just picture perfect. So I have a perfect view of the pool as well as the sea. So let's check it out. Look at that. So guys, I just took a shower, you know, because the day hot and it's just about what four four p.m. and I'm hot. We in Montego Bay, the sun are look on the sun, hot and nice, and look at that. The sun is about to set, and I'm gonna get some of that on camera. And let me tell you something: it's the most beautiful sunset. The sun sets in the west of Jamaica. That's in the Grill, Montego Bay, West Milan side. It's so beautiful. No. I want to show something, re the products that the camera use, right? So I noticed this in the bathroom. They use this Alaya Seashore product, right? And it says here, it's a Jamaican 
product, right? Now, this is interesting because even though the camera is a Spanish, um, what do you call it? A Spanish hotel, as you would say, they use Jamaican products. And I really like that because they didn't have to. You know, they could just say, okay, we're gonna import our own products, but they choose to use Jamaican products. This product is not bad. They have the, the body lotion, the shampoo, all products of Jamaica, and I like that. So, yeah, and also let me tell you about the towels. Oh my God, the towels felt so soft on my skin. Really, really nice high-end towel um, for me. Uh, so, around 6.30 I have dinner that they have here it's a la carte restaurant i guess that's what you would call it so it's not buffet style so you get to choose what you want to eat and for that restaurant you have to book a reservation so my reservation is at 6 30. after that we're going to go to Montego bay club for um entertainment which kicks off at about i think it's 7 30 or 9 30. um so i'm gonna get a bit of that when I come to hotels, I don't really do the whole entertainment thing, to be honest with you. I just want to sleep and relax and enjoy myself. That's me. Probably spend some time at the beach or by the pool. But that's just me. But yeah. So, I'm going to get ready. No, I'm going to watch the sun set first. And then I'm going to get ready. I'm going to pop that champagne. And yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Alright, hi guys. So, I'm here at the restaurant at the Cameron Cornwall Beach. And this is the menu. There we have it, everything, and I have my red wine. So good. I don't know what type of red wine, but it's good. And then check out the. Let me tell you, this place has the best views. You know, look at that. So nice. It's a happy anniversary here. Happy, what is it? Birthday. So. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna start off with the appetizer. They have a salad bar, and they also have spot of the day. What's the soup of the day? Vegetable soup. vegetable soup so i'm gonna have some of that mm, i'm either gonna do the beef or the salmon let's see so yeah i'm hungry so let's see so when the food comes i'm gonna share with you. all right so this is a a la carte restaurant and it's by reservations only um and you get to choose your menu so they have a buffet um dinner section and they also have this restaurant here so the menu is beef salmon they have shrimp um they have a vegetarian lasagna so you know they have for the for the vegetarian people and they have fish as well as dessert so yeah here is my soup just in time so this is the vegetable soup it looks healthy and nice and you get some rolls with it so i'm gonna taste it so i'm gonna taste it right now uh, yeah, I'll let you know how it is. Guys, I'm about to drink my soup. Not bad. <laughs> Body can pass, have carrots. It's a healthy meal, so. The food is here, so this is what we have ordered. This is the salmon that looks good. So like potato with vegetables. I don't know if you can see it with the lighting. This is shrimp laguini. Laguini, that's how you pronounce it, right? And this is beef. Yeah, so we're gonna dig in and see what it tastes like. So, one thing to note, if you're going to be out here and nothing, you need to carry a mosquito on them. I mean, it's a look of you. You're hearing the ocean, the music, the atmosphere, the time, but the mosquito are just feeling it. So, please walk with those mosquitoes on for health, right? They're going to eat your life. Just like what I'm eating this summer. But then.
Come on, 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 I like that. I'm gonna go to breakfast. Um, just to get something light. Um, it's seven fifty now. The buffet opens at seven o'clock, and I think until nine. And so I'm just gonna get something. You know, just film some stuff and get some, you know, something small. The rest of the day at ten, I have some water sports activity to do, so I'm gonna do that. Um, and then just chill for a little bit. I do work remotely right now, so I'm gonna be just doing some work, logging in, checking in, and you know, so it's, it's a bit gloomy. The sun is shining as you know I thought it would, but yeah. So let me go get something to eat, and of course my coffee. <laughs> See you in a minute. Good morning, good morning everyone. So I'm here at breakfast. I just turned up the music for some strange reason. So I'm here. I have some omelette, bacon, and potato. And of course, Jamaica Blue Mountain coffee. And I love my coffee in the morning. Mm. I don't know why she filled it up, but yeah. Um, this is it. I'm gonna taste it. It's a regular breakfast day. They don't have much um, breakfast option. They do have um, Jamaican food options like um, we had kidney and boiled food which is good. I love yam and banana. So. We love those who love, who love the Jamaican option. They do have it. But the breakfast option for me and the buffet is not white and that's what I didn't like that's what I don't like about this place but cool alright can go on So guys, I'm heading to my water sport excursion. I think it's just a glass bottom boat. I'm a little late, it should be for 10. It's five minutes after 10, so come with me on my adventure. And one thing to note is that the camera, they do offer water sports, but you have to go through them. So what happens is that you will have unauthorized um, tour, tour excursion um, boats that would come on shore and say hey you know come for this excursion you can get a discount um i've heard of unfortunate incidents where people actually go with them and they are violated so um you have to make sure that whatever excursion you go on you have to go through the cameron very important So the hotel offers a variety of water sports activities such as kayaking, sailboats and water bicycle trips. I decided to try the sailing and it was relaxing. Luckily there wasn't much wind to make the sail rough. You are required to sign a waiver before you do any of these activities. So after my sailing was finished, I fell for some coffee. I usually visit the cafe bar like at least two times for the day. So I decided to go for my regular top up. Let's go. Oh, 
how are you? I'm good enough. Come for my daily coffee. What would you like? The mocha. The coffee mocha? Alright. Yeah. The coffee mocha is different from the mocha that you have. What's the difference? The coffee mocha is cocoa powder. And the mocha that you have is. I'm going to try the, the, the coffee mocha. Alright, so. Alright, so. Now, parents, you're going to appreciate the Cameron Resort. It is kids friendly. They do have a few children activities that your kids can participate in. And we're going to check it out. Yeah, man. Hi, my name is Vanilla. I am the kids coordinator at the Cameron and we offer a wide variety of activities for the children as well as adults. So for example, today we're going to do what I call a color race. It's very simple. Depending on what color you have and what color the dice falls on my color dice, you move forward. So we have six faces and the first person to get to the end of the line wins. That's simple. We also do face painting, um, fish feeding and treasure hunts and picture scavenger hunts. So that's just a few of the things that we offer here to the children at Royal the Camden. Right. Man, I'm, I'm tired. I just woke up from my nap at 4 o'clock and I'm just waking up. It's around 6 o'clock and I just woke up in time to get the sun setting and it's beautiful. It's not as beautiful as before because we had the rain, um, but it's not bad. So we're going to check it out. Let's go. Let's do this. All right. kind of gone down but that's how this thing is beautiful and nice um and so far it's been nice um we're currently having what i call bad weather look at that not really bad but it's raining it's been raining um i think about 11 o'clock so i'm just here in my robe the, you do get a rope, so I'm just here, just relaxing, just doing some work. I kind of work remotely, so I'm um, here getting some work done. What I will say is that um, the internet sucks here. So if you're uploading or downloading stuff, then make sure you have some data backup here because it's not really working with me. I had to hotspot a lot from my, my phone. I have digital as my internet my network provider and just hotspot to my MacBook Pro to the work so it's a no unless you go in the lobby I'm not going there so I just want to stay in my room and do some work also offer spa services as well I also booked uh oh we have a plane we have a plane we have a plane that's what we can see we have a plane it's taking off it's taking off <laughs> anyway later I booked a spa treatment so I'll be doing a mini spa I'm going to tell you how that goes. I'm going to show the pricing and everything. So, look out for that. And I want to check out the grill. They have a grill and bar. You know, but the rain just sucks. It's outdoors, so the rain. So, um, that's it. I just waiting on the wearing to ease up so I can get some lunch. You know, if we're going to these all-inclusive hotels, we got to eat. we got to eat lots of good food. Yum, 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 yum. I am leaving. It's my last day here at the camera, and I'm leaving. So, I'm going to get some food the checkout is at 12 but even though the checkout is at 12 you're still allowed to eat food so i'm gonna get some 
food at their grill. I haven't tried their grill, so I'm gonna get some burger, hamburger, hot dogs. So yeah, I'm gonna check it out. All right. So this is their grill area. Hi guys, so I'm here at the Grill and Bar and I'm having a hamburger. That's the only thing that was ready at the time, but they do jerk chicken wings. Um, yeah, this is my last meal here at the camera and I'm so sad. I'm sad that I'm leaving. But yeah, check out this at 12 so, but you are allowed to have food here. So I think I'm going to have some food here. We're going to have some food here. And I got a pink lemonade. At the time, hot. Yeah, so my vacation time has come to an end. And that's why I'm here. All right. I wanted a little downtime here because I've been working so hard and I decided to treat myself to a spa treatment here at the resort. Now, you do have the option to do your spa treatment by the beach or inside the designated spa area. I decided to go inside as the time was just so hot. I needed that AC. So this is Miss Lydia and she did a good job with my massage. Say hi to the camera. Hi. <laughs> so if you're ever in if you ever come to the camera and need a massage, check out definitely check out Miss Lydia. Alright, thank you so much. All right, I'm leaving. It's my last day here at the Cameron, and I'm leaving. So there you have it, guys. My three days and two nights at the Cameron has come to an end. I enjoyed it here. It wasn't a bad stay at all for a budget-friendly resort located in Montego Bay. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you have not subscribed to my channel as yet, please do to stay tuned for all your Jamaican travel content. Thanks, guys, so much for your support. I really appreciate it. Until next time, see you soon.